dollar after. Front seat is horrible. Look at all of those things. Look at all those things. Got a cigarette hole right here. YouTube, YouTube, YouTube was popping. You know that grinding stuff. And shout out to my notification gang. Don't forget to get that bell to ring, man. And hey, man. Don't forget to like that video. All right, guys. We're in a box Chevy today. I'm finally, I'm cleaning out the back seats right now. Still water down there. I got to vacuum it out. I uh, already got, I got that side over there. So I pretty much cleaned this side. It ain't really picking it up too good on the camera, but I'm going to go. That's my once over. Then I'm going to go over here. It looked like they did most of the work in the back seat for some reason, but it looked like it's dirty. It's super dirty in the back seat. But yeah, I've been scrubbing. I made me some solution. And then I got me a bucket right here of soap and water. But I got this sprayer right here to make it easier. I got this sprayer to make it easier. If y'all want to get this, I'll probably put it in the uh, comments. But yeah, all you do, pump a couple times. Then you, all you got to do is just hold down on this. You ain't got to keep squirting. Then your fingers will get tired. So this the back though. I just sprayed it down so it can get uh, diluted and start breaking down some of the dirt. I did this in my Buick when I had my Buick too. So this stuff does work. And you can get the floor wet as long as you vacuum it out and let it air out. So I'm going to have to let these windows down at night and let it, uh, let everything air out. Yeah, I get this. I get this fixed. Don't worry about that. But yeah, check out the front seat for right now. And then I can show y'all after. Front seat is horrible. Look at all of those things. Look at all those things. Got a cigarette hole right here. It's, it feel good, though. But yeah, we're going to get it right. I'm gonna go ahead and knock out the rest of the uh knock out the rest of it. Get the uh brush. I got the drill brush, I'll show y'all that in a minute. But yeah. It ain't really got no rips in it, just a couple of cigarette holes. So I'm gonna try to get out all of these things to the best of my ability. It's not gonna be perfect, but I'll have it to where it's like drivable and decent. Um I haven't cleaned this door yet. This one not too bad. I cleaned that one over there. I'll show y'all in a minute. But yeah, I'm gonna get this. I'm gonna try to get all of this black stuff out of there. Get it cleaned out. I use a toothbrush. I use quite a few things. I use a toothbrush. I use, you see the the uh, big bristle brush. Yeah, I got this one right here. And I got the little toothbrush for the small crevices. So for the small crevices, you can get in like, you can get in here. You can get in between this, you know what I'm saying? Just. Just a lot of stuff like that. You see it's soapy right now because it's still it's still wet. So I'm trying to let it break down all the stuff by itself. But oh, here we go. Just the drill brush. I got the battery on the charger so it can do its thing. But pretty much, yeah, same concept. You just back and forth, back and forth, back and forth, back and forth, up, down, up, down, up, down, break down all the dirt. And then you need a rag. You do need a rag to uh get up all of this dirt so be aware of that i'm gonna get down with this back seat and then we're gonna try to do a before and after for y'all i mean, y'all like before and after so that's what we're gonna try to get done today i'm trying to detail i'm gonna detail the inside today and then i'll start detailing the, the outside probably this weekend or something like that or something along those lines There's no rush because i'm still working on getting the tags for it so we still gotta wait before we get the tags and then i do need to carburetor carburetor needs some adjusting because it try to kick back on even if, even if you turn it off so but yeah let me get back to work for it get dark i'm losing daylight two seconds all right y'all i'm losing light so i think i'm gonna call it a night and continue on with this process another day but yeah man it's it's coming a long way i'm about to go get the keys and go ahead and let the windows down so it can dry it's wet, so it look, it look dirty. It look dirty, but it's a lot cleaner than what it was. Got most of the stains out the floor. I'm probably gonna have to go over it a couple times. I got that seat belt hanging up because it had some rust on it. So I cleaned the seat belt and then make sure it was straight. And then we got the front seat. Y'all remember them stains that was in there? Stains pretty much gone. Remember I said I was gonna try to get them stains that was like right up in here out? I got those out pretty much. So just need to let it dry. I need to go and finish that driver's side and then I'll be done with this. But I'm going to go ahead and knock it out tomorrow. 
Go spend some family time. That dope clean. Yeah. That's uh so really all I gotta do is that carpet over there and then that seat over there. Then I'll be pretty much done with the inside. And then I can determine then I can determine how um uh, how much I need to go over it again. Hopefully I don't. Hopefully it's good. Yeah, this the this the driver's side. It ain't too bad. But I can get those things out like I got them out on this side. And then I got to get some floor mats. Some floor mats for sure. But I did clean this door already. So it's kind of, it's drying still. I had to go over it a couple times. I cleaned the steering wheel up a little bit. And get the, you need to get a cover on that. I wiped down the dash. The dash is a little cracked. But that's expected. It's an 86. So Yeah, man, we, we, we're getting somewhere. All of this stuff was, it was stuff all back here. So we cleared it all out. It do need a, uh, a vi I mean, not a visor, but a, whatever the thing called up there. But I am getting a roof put in here, so I might just keep it. Most likely I'll just keep it, uh, keep it undone until I can actually get the sunroof put in it. I don't know if I want, I want to get one that like, the one that got like five things when it go back. And then uh, I do plan on getting the little, the little half top. I only want a quarter top. I mean, I want I want about a quarter top, but I want that fat one though. I want the one that that meaty one. That's what I want. But yeah, man. If you're new to the channel, don't forget to hit that subscribe button. Don't forget to like the video, man. And we'll be out of here. We'll be. You can catch me on the next one. More videos coming. More videos coming for the box. But yeah, man. We'll we'll catch y'all on the next one. Peace.